Painting down the value scale from light through middle value, then finishing with the darks, is what Don calls the traditional approach. Figure painters in watercolor have used this time-tested approach for generations. The big advantage to the traditional approach, Don says, is that you get actively involved in the painting before making any major commitments. By starting with delicate washes, the artist can see the painting taking shape and still have lots of room for alterations and adjustments. In the first phase of this demonstration, Don challenges himself to be bold when painting the lights. Because we're comparing the first washes to white paper, it's difficult to judge values properly in the beginning stages of the painting. If it looks right when it's wet, Don says, it's wrong. Once the lights are established, Don works into the middle value range, introducing the all-important shadow pattern. Shadows tell the story of the form and make the figure three-dimensional. Don calls painting the shadow pattern the structural phase of the painting. Don paints from the figure into the background in each stage of development, so unity is established between the dominant shapes of the figure and the supporting shapes of the background. The painting is then finished with the introduction of a few selected areas of dark. The traditional approach, painting down the value scale from light through middle value and then adding the darks, will have a long and healthy future in watercolor, Don predicts, because he says it works.